Hello! In celebration to my new EP Chemicals, I asked myself five questions. How silly is that? But this is the way to go. And after that, I will talk about my new track Grey. So check it out. First question When do you start producing? So I think it was 10 years ago. When I first started producing, I was playing piano a lot, about 13 to 15 years, I think, and the organ, and I moved to another city, and there I had no piano, so I bought myself Ableton and did computer music, and this was my first touch with electronic music. And after I was in, after my holidays in Ibiza, back in 2011, I got first touch to trance and progressive scene and I was so fascinated about this music that I wanted to make this by myself. So 10 years ago from now, 10 years has passed, I do a, still do a lot of uh, music and it's very fun. So next question, what was your favorite production of yours? So well, really hard to say because I give 100% um, on every production I do but if I name one production I would say it's Jamaica because I, I, I always wanted to make this style melodic progressive house that uh, Tinker produced back in 2008 and I think this Jamaican track comes very close to the style and I'm really happy how it came all together. And it's very melodic and energetic and that's what I like about trance music. Basically it has everything what I like about trance music. Did your music style change? Yes, I think so, so because I try to <clears throat> Try out new things and keep keep the ball rolling. Develop myself and to just make music what's fun to me. And I cannot do all just melodic progressive house because for me it gets boring. I want to do an other styles like trance music, club music, and now this new EP is about deep deep music, deep progressive what you can play as a warm-up track or what you can play in a bar. So this, this styles always change to me. Next question. Any tips for music production starters? So I think the, the tip I can give is just to have fun, just to do this kind of music that is that comes from your heart not what I don't want to hear but just that what you are feeling right now and if you follow this I think you will make your path anyways so last question did COVID-19 influence your music basically I don't I don't know but um, what I can say is that if you do not meet a lot of people or have your life basically in your own um, apartment, then you lose a lot of colors and inspiration. So it was not so easy for me to get inspired and make good music. And this is <clears throat> also leads to my um, background about gray, the track gray. So really wanted to make something different, not have this 404 kick loop every time. So my idea was to basically mix liquid bass with deep trance or deep progressive and combine it. <clears throat> um, and Grey is about development. It has many themes and ups and downs. And this is, this is the story behind Grey, also the lack of colors and inspiration 
gray the time we we um, experienced what i experienced was a little bit gray and um i think i think I, i'm very happy about this track because it's something completely new and it's it's cool to, to make something completely new and i hope you like gray it's coming out on thursday this thursday and on spotify itunes speedpod and all other stores and i would be very happy if you like comment or share my track gray and this this is all about it next week i can share a new tutorial about my a side from this ep chemicals and hope you check this out too so stay healthy and goodbye see you